okay so now let's create a c sharp script by the name of m account open mg player ui and rifle and on the rifle we will try and draw the text now let's open up the script okay and in here we move that we will be dealing with the ui so we need to add that at the top using unity engine.ui and then let's create a reference to our ammo so we will simply say public text ammunition text okay and then we need a reference to our magazine so we will say public text mag text after this we need to create a occurrence for this so you can say our instance and when we will have an instance then we can update these to wherever we want so right here say public static m account which is the script name and let's name this as occurrence and then in the awake function we will say occurrence equals to this after that let's create a function for updating our ammo so we will say public void update ammo text in here we will be needing the present ammunition so let's pass a variable in here by the name of present ammunition and then in here what we will do we will say ammunition text okay which is this one to this we will add this ammo text okay we will assign this ammo text so now we want to update the ammo text so for that we will say ammunition text or text will be equals to ammo dot we will give some space in between and then we will show the present ammunition of the rifle okay and after this we want to show the magazines so for that we will create a function by the name of update mag text and here we will be needing our magazine variable which we will be passing from the rifle script okay to this one and then when we have the total number of magazines in the rifle then we will say make text dot text will be equals to magazines I think we need to have dot and space and then right here we will show the magazines okay this was the script now let's go ahead and open up the rifle script and right here as you can see we leave a comment to show the ammo text and right here we will actually show the ammo out text okay right here we are updating the UI so we will say ammo count dot occurrence dot what was the function it was update ammo text and the update ammo text requires present ammunition so our rifle present ammunition variable name is where is it present ammunition okay so we will pass that right here and then for the magazine we will do the same we will say ammo count dot Occurrence dot this time we will update the magazine text and for the mag we will simply pass the mag variable it is this one so now save it get back right here let's assign the ammo text within the magazine text and now this should work let's play the game okay when we pick up the rifle now when we shoot our magazine and ammo text will be updated as you can see now it shows magazine 10 and ammo you can see the ammo is decreasing and now when we when the player uh, reload let the player reload okay Okay, now the player is reloading and as you can see the magazine is now 8 let's shoot again and now the magazines are 7 
now let's fire again now the magazines are six okay so now we have a fully functional player ui and the only thing now we want to do is to dis uh, disable this ammo and magazines okay when you don't have the rifle we don't want to show that and when you pick up the rifle then you want to show that text okay actually let me fire once okay we have ammo 32 and magazines 10 let's come right here our ammo is 32 and magazines are 10 okay now leave it as it is and now let's deactivate this when we don't have the rifle so on the clear punch let's add a reference to the ammo ui okay first let me just move the backward and now right here we will say public actually let's remove that from here and open up the rifle pickup okay right here let's add a reference to our rifle ui so we will say public game object rifle ui and when the rifle pickup is activated then we want the rifle ui to be deactivated okay so when this awakes then with the rifle we also want the rifle ui to be not shown so we will say rifle ui dot set active let's set this to false click save get back to unity click on pickup rifle and in there we need to provide the rifle ui let's drag and drop that now if we play the game you will notice that it will be this will be deactivated as you can see the rifle is being deactivated we just now on the seat held now when we pick up the rifle then we want the rifle ui to be shown so in order to now show that we need to go back to the rifle script and when the rifle script is being activated then we want to show that so let's go ahead copy that from there on the rifle after this let's add that and also let's copy that and in the awake we will now set this to true okay now save it okay and now click on the AKM and right here we need to provide the UI again now so drag and drop that in there so now this will work properly okay you will notice that this is activated now but when we play the game you will notice that it is now gone we can now only punch now if we pick up the rifle and as you can see it is showing the rifle UI okay and now when we shoot as you can see it just decrease so now we have a fully functional player UI and in the next video we will work on our menus so with this done catch you guys in the next one